Remember woolly mammoths? Scientists are bringing them back to life and the results might surprise you. So this company called Colossal started working on the idea in 2021. And the biggest reason to study woolly mammoths is to understand how they were able to survive in such extreme weather conditions. Woolly mammoth extinction is relatively recent on the astronomical scale, only a few thousand years old. And since they were mainly populated in the northern hemisphere, their DNA is very well preserved. Scientists have been trying to perfect CRISPR, a gene editing tool that was developed in 2012. And now they're finally able to develop an embryo, which can now be put in to a surrogate subject. They call this the extinction. So attaching the embryo of a woolly mammoth to a modern day elephant seems to be the most straightforward way to conduct the experiment, right? Yeah, but here's a little problem. The elephant takes about two years to give birth. Not exactly time efficient. The scientists at Colossal came up with an absolutely genius idea. They took woolly mammoth embryo and implanted it in 12 female mouse, who then gave birth to 38 mouse and all of them successfully carried the woolly mammoth fur. Not only that, but these mouse also showed a stark difference in their metabolism very similar to woolly mammoth. This is one of the most groundbreaking studies in the history of human race and in the future it could not only help us bring back the extinct species but also help us save the endangered species. A little update, at the time of recording this video, the same company Colossal successfully brought dire wolves back to life. More on this soon.